Hello everybody, Sword here. Still playing the Division. Still having a hell of a time. This game's great. Anyway, today we are on to the Subway Morgue Mission 3 or 4. I keep forgetting about that one in Brooklyn. Um, team up with other agents, Subway Morgue. Now, I am judging these mission numbers by their level. First mission was level 4, 5, this one's 6. Locating <coughs> uh, I think the next one is 8. These guys are fun, because you can do this. Oh, missed. Get back here. There. Now, it doesn't kill them because of their level. Here we go. But it does, I believe it disable. I don't know if it disables their flamethrowers or not. I'm having too much fun shooting them at the. shooting their backpacks. Uh, uh, apparently, that guy just spotted me. And he's dead. Alright. Ooh, a green. Useless, useless green. I don't think I've equipped a green in a while, mainly because... Oh, hmm? Oh. There's a civilian I can give something to up there. There's also a chest that is still glowing. I'm going to open this. I think I grabbed this chest. Yeah, alright, I did. There's a chest here. Behind a locked thing that I just wasted the a lock pick for. And there should be one guy with them. It's either aim for their head or aim for their feet. He's got a big shield, or you could shoot the shield until it blows up. Which is a nice way of saying he's a paranoid jackass. why I'm having frame issues right now. Might be the recording. Hi guy. Oh, he survived! Man, that guy's tough. So you get extra experience for headshots and extra experience if they don't die, which is annoying. I mean, then have you have to execute them, and that's just not We're nice. Alright. Bye, guy. Yeah, I'm guaranteeing it's the... frame drops. Oh well. Well, I will deal with it. Might be, uh... Project was intended as an extension of the subway running system. my system they too hot. Anyway, there's a chest back here. Morning. Readings indicate this area is contaminated. And we'll go back. We're at uh, Meat Roads. Exiting the contaminated area. Activate power relay. We'll listen to Roads just as soon as we turn this thing on. There we go. Confirmed. Global power back. Online. Whoever just turned on the lights, you're either JTF or you're really fucking lost. Either way, thanks. Hi, Roads. patching in. We have help on the way, Roads. Whoever's down here. Head for the secondary relay room. And when you see the dead bodies, get your masks on quick. Otherwise, All right. you're dead. Die, guy. Oh.
that guy. So you suppress them, you can get extra. I believe suppressing them causes you to do more damage to them. It also prevents them from action. Remember, always use the environment against your enemy. Especially enemies when they have flamethrowers, because that's never a fun thing. Hate the big guys with flamethrowers. Alright. You can follow directions? Probably. I'm gonna need your help. Whatever assistance you need. I have Garrus talking to me, so. Because I need some relay boxes swapped out. Garrus Vicarian is my computer. Now of course I can listen area. and now leaving the contaminated area. take him out and another guy's gonna come up around here there he is then pick up this giant thing <clears throat> which causes you to only use your sidearm slide it in there just putting it in apparently activates it Go. Oh, he's suppressed. Good. Son of a bitch. It's actually working. No more bleeding coming in from the man. No one more hacks like that. They're here. Get them. I didn't use the environment to my advantage, but I, relo I did reload in time. Because of this thing. Which in the beta was not blow upable. Now this mission was in the beta. It was the mission added to the open beta. So I don't believe it was in the closed one. I think, I think only Madison was. Warning. Hostiles inbound on your position. Feck off. Guy coming. Here he is. Feck off. It says there's a guy over here. Alright. Freaking Garrus is leading me off. So yeah, the voice of the uh, computer, Isaac, is the voice of Garrus Vicarian. For those who played Mass Effect, at this point I don't think there's many people who haven't played Mass Effect. Go. Can I secondary power relay? Okay. I locked onto the wrong area. Hi guy. Oh a headshot. Alright. Grab the blue. And onto another chest. I believe this is a special chest. Excuse me. Uh, yep, there's a special chest here. I've already opened it, so I can't open it again. Warning. You are now entering a contaminated area. And we'll head over this way. 
Back around here. <clears throat> All right. So. The contaminated area. Warning. Hostiles inbound on your position. Where's the other one? There we go, so take out the two. Grab the thing again. You can quickly drop it just by hitting the button to equip a different weapon. And there's going to be guys coming out of that door. Oh, he survived too. One more area where guys are going to come. Morning. Hostiles inbound on your position. And as I said, use the environment to your advantage. Because it doesn't take much to blow things up. Now where'd I drop that thing? There we go. Ooh, there's a thing over here. The only downside about carrying... Oh, f eight. The only downside about carrying things is you can't run. Walk at the same slow-ass speed. And hopefully I don't fall through the level again. Done that a couple times. Activate power relay. Oh. Um oh, restock. And the control room is where things end. Soon we get out of this fucking crypto better. There's roads. Hey there. Hang on a sec. Hi Rhodes. Testing, testing. Jesus, this thing is loud. Alright, so okay. this the work in the control room now. is where the first group of enemies comes out. Just want to give you a heads up. It's going to get real dark real fast. Can't get power to the base unless they do a reboot or so. Alright. Everything's going to shut down for a minute. Come on, Rhodes. Fuck me. <laughs> they went top of the line with the generators. I, I can't see you anymore. Someone. Come on! Shut the hell up, Rhodes. Just trying to deliver power to all of Manhattan. What do you know? It's alive. Oh, crap. Clean it. I thought you took care of it. Here we go. Open the door. Group one. Group two will come from across the way. Over there. Really? Oh man, this guy's elusive. There we go. And from over there. God, I play this too much. Morning. Hostiles inbound on your position. And here. That's more your people. And for the boss.
This is the guy I was talking about when I said I don't like uh, big guys with flamethrowers. Go. You hit the three explosive things on him and he goes down pretty quick, especially when you're doing, what, a million damage to him per hit? So that's the boss. 16 minutes. Yeah, I play this game too much. Oh well. So mission number four. Okay. There we go. In the words of Paul Rhodes, that is all she wrote. Into the elevator, and up we go. Alright. No elevator music. is a lot more stable. Thanks to you, we're back in business. Rhodes is already on his way back in, so no need to give him an escort. I'll see you when you get here. Alright, so with that, just like the previous two missions, you now travel to uh, the base of operations. Right here, the post office. And unlock Tech wing. First what thing you unlock is the explosive grenade gun thing. That was an LMB, that was a rioter. Yeah, we would have been fine without you. Yeah, probably, but Alright. So, yeah, you unlock the uh, grenade gun. Do some more stuff, you unlock the turret that I have. Alright, well, till next time, y'all have a good day.